Paolo in Turin, Italy, writes to me and he says, Paul, this is Paolo from Italy. Hey, Paolo, this is Paul from Boulder. <laughs> I wonder if it would be possible to stream directly in DSD. Maybe this is already done and I'm simply not aware of it. If streamed, the DSD flow would be understood by the DACs currently available on the market. Oh, he's asking a question. Would they be currently available to, uh, uh, on, uh, to DACs on the market? Thank you in advance, Paolo. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. We do that all the time. Not, not, not every DAC will understand DSD, but most of them will. So let me ex explain just a little bit. We know, I think we know, DSD is pulse density modulation. It's one bit as opposed to PCM, which is multi-bit. PCM is 16, 24, 32 bits that make up numbers, and it's done in words where PDM, or DSD, is a continuous stream uh, running at a much higher rate. So single rate, what we call the lowest DSD out there, is running at 64 times faster than a CD, which is about 2.8 megahertz. Now, a CD runs at 44,000 times a second. The, the rate of single rate DSD is running quite a bit higher, like I say, 2.8 megahertz. We at Octave Records are starting to move over to 256, DSD 256, which is 256 FS, meaning it's 256 times higher sample rate, higher speed than a CD, and that's running at about 11.2 megahertz. Really, really high quick bandwidth, lots of data in there that needs to be you know, taken care of. Now computers, whether they be Apple or, or um, Microsoft, Windows, those two operating systems, or Linux, None of those three operating systems can deal with DSD. They, it, their systems do not know what the heck to do with DSD. Just, you know, oh, whatever it is. I don't know what it is. So in order to pass DSD through the computer, whether uh, it's from, from a streaming service that you then, you know, or you record it, you, whatever you've done, unless you have a special program that knows what to do with it, it's, it's going to be lost. So what we do is we trick the computer by creating something called DOP, and that is DSD over PCM. And it's actually pretty simple. So in PCM, let's just take a 24-bit signal, and we said that's multi-bit, right? So eight of those bits are going to be what we call a header, and a header is the start of each word in a PCM stream, and that header says, hey, here's who I am, here's what I do, and here's what I'm looking for, and it's an instruction set that is telling the computer where this packet of information needs to go and what to do with it, okay? So we keep that header, and we tell a little bit of a fib. We say, well, what's gonna follow is uh, PCM. And the computer goes, oh, okay. And the next 16 bits are actually a 16-bit chunk out of the DSD. But since it's all just bits, the computer doesn't care. Ones and zeros, right? That's all we need to know. And then, so we take the DSD stream, we cut out the first 16 bits, we pop it in with an 8-bit header, boom. You have DOP, DSD over PCM. Now, the next thing you need to do is to have a driver inside of the DAC or inside of the computer that knows what you're connecting to and what to do with it. So a driver, you've heard of printer drivers, you've got to load the driver, you've got, you've got to, the computer has to know what to do with certain amounts of data, right? So if you have a DAC that understands DOP and can reverse this whole process so that what you wind up with is pure DSD, which is what you'll get, um, you need to have a proper driver that says, ah, I know what that is, tricky little guy. And then it puts it over here into the DAC, separates out, throws away the header, puts all the DSD stream back, and bing bada boom. As Curly would do. Mm. 
Um, we <laughs> now we have DSD again, but that's the way we do it. We do it by tricking the computer. So yes, we can stream that from a computer to a DAC and make it work just great. Any PS Audio DAC is, is, will happily stream uh, DOP and, and DSD because obviously we're very big fans of that whole thing. So, Alrighty, hope that helps. Thanks for the question. I'll talk to you later.